Hey y'all, it's your girl Suzette with Crafting with Susie coming to you today with a new video. Um, I got such a good response from my stash, how many is too many. I decided to show you all exactly what I have in my own personal stash. But before I get started, there she is. Plant Witch, y'all. Finally, I finished her up last night. I was like, we're getting done with this. Look how pretty. Ain't she pretty? Now, you know I have to critique myself. Um, I just might go back and put white ABs in here. Just put them in here. These are white, so I think I'm just gonna, it's not that many at all. Um, I think I'm gonna go back and put some white ABs in there because I put them in the flowers here. I did the yellow, of course, and the white, so I think I'm gonna put the white here. I don't know how I missed it because I got it everywhere else, but I'm going to go back and just do that and that'll just take a few minutes, but she's done. And she is so pretty. Like that is my favorite part, of course, when they're finished, let me move this back. I hope I don't knock anything off. When they're finished and you see how good they actually really, really look. And she looks good. So I wanted to just show you guys this real quick. I am going to try to do this stash reveal in one video. Y'all bear with me, it's gonna be quick. I'm not gonna go into too much detail on each painting. I just kinda don't think it's necessary because honestly, being completely honest, unless you're new to diamond painting, you all have seen these before and that's just the truth because we all pretty much buy the same thing. Um, see, I'm already knocking stuff over. <laughs> I'm already knocking stuff over. Okay, so of course, as I always do, my disclaimer, some of these paintings have come from websites that do sell stolen painting. When you know better, you do better. So I personally, don't buy um, off sites that sell stolen artwork. And honestly, for me, cause I don't know what is and what isn't. So I just basically stay away from it now. But in the beginning when I was um, purchasing them, that's where I was getting my diamond paintings from. So I'm gonna get rid of this. Just place her on the floor real quick. And let's get started, y'all. So first things first, I have these small ones from Fan Sales. I'm just gonna open one of them. These are the snacks that I was talking about. They're like 30 by 40. So if they're kind of simple paintings. They are full, not partial. This one would be around. You see, it's not even that many colors. It's really small. And this one is, I call it flowers. I just mark them all so I know what they are. I've even given these away to people. Uh-oh. So this is what it would look like. You see how tiny it is? And it says it's a 30 by 40. But you see how small it is? And it is a full. And they're like on fan sales, like some of them can, the price can be up there, but these are like five, six dollars. So that's what I was talking about the other day in my other video. I just have a few of those and they do come, the kits aren't in here because I took them out, but they do come with the standard kit, which is the pin, the bags, and the wax and the tray. So you do get, that with each of them. I think there's five here. So, ah, 
Now onto the good stuff. I'm just going to start with, okay, no, I'm going to start with this. So I have these. These have come from different places. Some of these are double-sided tape. So that's why you have the covering like this on them. So I can show you what it looks like. And probably what I'll try to do is insert pictures. But this is a woman, she has a large afro, butterflies in her hair. Um, if you watched my first video, when I talk about the diversity in paintings, a lot of times when you try to get women of color, especially African-American, they always have a head wrap, like always. So that's why I got this one off AliExpress, no head wrap. Um, this next one, she does have the head wrap. You can see her through the paper here. She does have the head wrap, but she's beautiful. This also came from AliExpress. This is another one that came from fan sales. I keep saying I'm gonna do it because I know this is gonna look bomb. I still haven't done it. Um, let's see here. Okay, so this one <laughs> was my first attempt of doing squares and I was like, y'all remember I, this has been a year so and I was like ooh I don't like it I stopped and I never went back to it it's a little bear holding a flower pot and it squares I started it and didn't finish it then I must have been crazy I don't know what I was thinking this is a round it's a tree I know y'all can see all that confetti underneath that paper like what were you thinking i don't know what i was thinking buying this not knowing what i was doing but it's a tree that's what it looks like um this also came from aliexpress just not i'm telling you when you learn what you're doing you'll be fine um this is another one this is a African-American woman. She is in a dress with a large hat. I used to do my all my paintings like this. I don't do it anymore. I section them off with washi tape. That one came from AliExpress. And I do use clothespins on hangers to hang them up. And I also put them underneath the mattress if they're too wrinkly. Um, Here's another one. This is a woman with a head wrap with an elephant that came from AliExpress. So these are older ones that I purchased. And this one is music notes with roses. And this one is a square. Look at this thing. Who's doing this? <laughs> um, hold on. And these are the double-sided adhesive. But that's what it looks like. The roses, it's pretty. It's just like, but what was I thinking? Getting something this big in a square when I didn't even know what I was doing yet. So it's roses with the music notes and This one, oh, this is an Alice in Wonderland one. Um, this one is also a square. This is an Alice in Wonderland. And I honestly want to know how this one's going to turn out. Is it going, is the image going to really show through? It's large, so it should. But you see all that detail? So I wonder if it's going to show through really good. All right, now, done with that. Now to this. 
Mary's Diamonds. So if you watched my IG live that I did, child, I'm not going to even go into it. Y'all need to watch that. But I'll show you the two from Mary Simons. I did not post these boxes in my picture um, the other day because, but I have this one. I believe this one is called Moon Girl. So this one, and I also have Mirage this one look at that is that not look oh my gosh that is absolutely beautiful so when i get the other one i'm supposed to be getting another one for mary's diamonds then i will go over and explain about these otherwise just watch my um it's ig live that i did mm, child so <laughs> now on to the good stuff. I'm just going to do Diamond Art Club because this is a hot mess. It's a lot. So real quick, let me just toss these up here. So they used to do this. They used to do if you, they would be free. I don't know about this one being free. This one look kind of big. But anywho. They would be free and you just had to pay for the um, shipping. And is this one? I actually have one that this was the very first one I ever purchased and um, did and completed. But um, I wanted to get all four of them and I just paid for the, the shipping, of course. So. I don't know if this was included. This one looks kind of big. So I'm wondering if that one was included. I don't know. Um, then next I have, this is not in any particular order. It's just what I got. Beautiful death colored. I got this for the butterfly event. Here's that one by Jojo Art. And that is a round. Then there's woo, Rococo, and she is a square, and I got her during the Black Friday sale. Remember how they tricked us? They did it, and then they did a second one. They got me on the second one with her. This is Psalm 8, and this is also a square. I got this during the um, Black Friday event. That's Mandy Mazzano, right? Yes. So that one. And then I got, should I turn it this way? Can y'all see it better? Ah, Virgo, this is heavy. <laughs> Virgo square. I got this one also during the Black Friday. Man, if y'all haven't seen that one completed, it's beautiful. Um, that one was heavy. Then I have Cottage by the Sea. Is that, and that's a Chuck Pinson square. And I like his beach scenery ones better than I do the like old fashioned old house ones. Um, then I got the Bayou Lady. For me to say I don't like squares, I think that's what I've shown all so far. But the Bayou Lady, because they're, we're, they're not bringing it back. So I had to hurry up and get it last minute. So I got her. Um, I'm trying, y'all, I'm trying. Angel Dream. So I moaned and groaned about having to wait three months, legit three months, can y'all the lighting, there we go, to get this in the mail, cause it was a pre-order. Well, I had a pre-order, 
but then everything hadn't come in. You see, this is still not done after all that moaning and groaning I did. Mm, mm, mm. So that's Angel Dream. And this is what I'm talking about. This is another Chuck Pinson, the way it used to be. This is the very first one I ever bought by him. And I bought it because so many people talk about his artwork. And I've seen this one done. It is pretty. But now that I'm really into diamond painting, I like his beach scenes better. Um, yes. Let's see. Young Green Sea Turtle. This is the one that I bought off of Instagram. Someone was doing the D stash I was talking about. Y'all, these colors are bomb. And it is a square. So that's another one. I'm gonna have a mess to have to clean up. All right, oh, and then this one is another Mandy Manzano, Forever In My Heart. I had never even seen this one with the baby. I was like, where have I been? That is so cute. And every time I see it, I keep saying I wanna do it, but I end up doing something else. <laughs> okay, oh yes. Island Time. Oh, I never opened this? Island Time. That is beautiful. I have seen this one completed. Someone had it on their YouTube channel. And man, I was like, I'm getting that thing. I am getting it. It's a square, and this is another Chuck Pinson. His beach fronts are beautiful. It's the colors. There's so many colors. Um, then there is this one. Please, this I believe this is Hannah Lynn. Oh, it is, duh, it says it right there, Suzette. Trixie, I was gonna do this one for the event, for the punk event, but I changed my mind, I'm doing something else. I usually don't do the ones from Hannah Lynn with the larger heads or whatever. Mona, I did, she's my favorite. I think I got that one and maybe one more and that's it. Maybe one more. Um, Camellia Lady, Manny Manzano. Yes, I have a theme. I love Manny Manzano. She has beautiful artwork. And she, just for a quick, quick second, she is an artist where other sites have taken her paintings and changed them to sell them. Like, that's just blatant, but Yes, and she talks about that on her Instagram all the time. So this one is uh, a nice one. I like this one. I buy quite a few of hers. Um, this one, Balloons by Mark Deverne. I When I did an unboxing on Instagram, I asked, why, don't, why didn't more people buy this one? I have yet to even see this done maybe once maybe once but i think it's so pretty it's the dress so i don't know i like it um all right now we're getting down to the nitty gritty so this one is by donna glight gelsinger forest foss friends this was actually supposed to be done for the end of the year holiday, but I ended up doing the horse one. It was the two horses in the snow, which ended up being beautiful. I forgot, ooh, almost called the name. I forgot what it was called. Ready for the ride, ready for the ride. That one came out nice. So I got this one here. And then there is Siamese Fighting Fish. It's a round. I wanted this one. Still ain't opened it. <laughs> I wanted it. I've seen this one done. It's pretty. And last but not least is Seasons Change. And out of all of my diamond art club, out of all of them, this one is the one I bought that I said, 
I shouldn't have bought this one. I don't know. Like it's, it hasn't been unwrapped. I didn't do an unboxing and I wanted it and I did it and I've seen it done. Um, I don't know. It's pretty. I got it because of course the antlers, but when I got it, I was like, Ugh, maybe not. So next we're going to do treasure studios art. Um, they do not use, Oh, let me back up diamond art club. They use port glue. So they don't use, um, the, like the double sided tape. They use port glue. Then treasure studios art. They use a, an adhesive on here that is not um port glue but it's almost like it it's better than the double-sided tape so i have done an unboxing of these but this one is cherry blossom these are all round this is cherry blossom and i actually when i got these i bought them in a set of three it was a little cheaper to do it that way and then this one is Flora, and these are all by Lizzie Falcone. This one was really nice. It didn't show up real nice on the uh, camera, but it's beautiful. And then I have Milkshake. This one is cute. All the sweets in her hair. This one's cute. All right, let's start getting this video. Oh no, we good, we 22 minutes. Next, I'm going to do uh, Distracted by Diamonds. So I just did an unboxing of this one, which is music with the glow in the dark drills. She has the Etsy shop, it's under Patty Wax. Oh, let's see here. And then I have Space Letterman 2. that one and those two both are rounds those two both are poured glue this one is I literally not can't say this one so I'm just gonna say that it's a moth it's the moth I did do an unboxing of this one I have it up on my channel I'll leave links to those and this one is a square this is the one that I said was creepy beautiful. So I love that one. The colors, y'all, the colors on that one. I'm telling you. Then I have, um, oh, the night. And I'm just gonna tell you really quick, distracted by diamonds, y'all know I always have to give her a little shout out, but she, I got the first one for this one and it had a hole in it. And of course I knew it was not something that she had done. It was the printing company. But when I let her know, I did send her a picture of the front and the back of the canvas cause the hole went straight through. And she was so sweet. It was around Thanksgiving and Black Friday. She said she would send me a new one and I knew not to rush her cause I knew she was gonna be busy. I just was like, it's fine. And I asked her, did she want me to send the other, I said, are you gonna send me a label so I can send the other kit back? And she told me no, because she wouldn't be able to get rid of it. Well, I figured somebody would take it. I just personally didn't um, want it. So I may end up giving it away in a giveaway if somebody wants it or it's a small hole, but it's a hole. It is a small hole, but it's a hole. Um, so then I have Dawn. Y'all don't even want to know how long it took me to get this thing. You could not get Dawn at all, period. You just couldn't. So I finally got her. This is a round and I have, oh, did I, oh, wait a second. Give me one second. Okay. 
Then I have this one, uh, the mermaid. I didn't get both mermaids. I just got this one and I got this one because of that beautiful pink hair. Yes. I almost did this one. I ended up doing something else. I had this out ready to go to. So that's the square. Um, this one is ah, two spirits. So I got this one and this one also is a square. The colors in this one are amazing. It is a beautiful painting, beautiful, beautiful painting. Um, I'll do this one I know sometime this year. I like this one. And then in my little bag <laughs> is neon. So what happened was is I was ordering so fast because I was so excited to even get neon. I didn't realize what I was ordering was neon and dawn canvas only no drills so what i ended up having to do was order from is it diamond drill usa i think that's what it's called i ended up ordering a bunch of drills from them like you just do the dmc code how many you'll need and i ended up ordering from them so i actually have a dawn painting in here no drills and then neon and then i had to buy the drills the um if you ever seen neon it's a bunch of yellow um around her and okay i'll just show you neon well that one's dawn of course ah. so she has a lot of yellow around her it's like that yellow is what number oh it's not on here it's on my phone sorry but anyway i ended up what i ended up doing is going to going online converting the dmc code for number one which is 973 for um diamond dots because Diamond Dots does not use the normal DMC codes. So there is a conversion chart online. I ended up doing that and I got all the yellow from um, Diamond Dots. I just went in there, like they're over there on my dresser. But I just brought a bunch of them to make sure I could cover everything. And I made sure I got some AB drills for like the blue in her lips. I'm just gonna do a little bit, like the center of her lips and then everything else regular. And I'll probably put some ABs down here in her necklace. But this is the one that I chose for the punk event because when, I don't know nothing about that, honey. I don't know what that is. But when she said Afro punk, I knew what that was. And so I was like, I was like, let me take my old self on the internet and look up some Afro punk. When I saw them people, I was like, yes, sis, that is neon 100%. So Trixie had to go back in the box and we will be doing this one right here. Yes. Oh, just in case y'all haven't ever seen Dawn. Oh, let me turn her around, which I'm sure you all have. Everyone does Dawn. So I have two of her, just no <laughs> drills, just no drills. I mean, you can get drills, but so there she is. And then lastly, I have my diamond dots. And I'll go ahead and go through them really quick. And that's it. Yeah, that's it. Okay. So with diamond dots, I'll do this one first. This one is Autumn Wolf. This is a square. They just came out with squares uh, this year. Um, I have not, like I said before, I haven't seen the drills that are in squares 
that they sell individually, just the rounds, but I'm sure they're coming. So at the time, this is the only one that I saw that I really liked. It is pretty, the burgundies. When I go to the store now, there's a lot more. And that's the only square that I have for diamond dots. Everything else is round. This one is pretty much a sack size. It's a 28 by 29 centimeter. And this is miniature magic. It's a partial. And I really think, and with them, they'll show you what you're doing. See, they'll show you what you're painting. It's only the bird, the hummingbird. Um, everything else is just the canvas. So I got that one and I got Wheat Fields by Van Gogh. This is a full. I love the yellow. So that one's a full. Um, and then I got, oh, I thought this one was so cute. Mother and Baby Owl. This is also a partial, but it's not too bad because um, the area that you're painting is nice size. So I have this one. I like that one. It's cute. And then I got these off the actual website. This is Rainbow Chums. Oops, sorry. And it actually does come with a cover minder. It's not magnetic. It's just a little heavier. So it holds um, the plastic back, the, um, the wrapping that's on it. It just holds it back. It does come with a gold, uh, what is that? Diamond painting pen. It's right here. Oh, and this one has ABs in it, honey. Right, yeah. The yellow and the blue. Uh, let me see. Okay, so it comes with this, and like I said, I have. I, yeah, this is Diamond Dots at home. I don't think I've seen this in the stores, so I know I went online to order the next two. But that's what it looks like, and it has their uh, marketing on the back. So it says diamond dots at home, 13 facets. So there's that. And then in their kit, there's the bags, the tray, the wax. I love their wax. I do. And then their pin. And it has a little diamond at the top. It's a normal pin. It's just that it's gold. It's just something that's different. But it does the same thing as the other pins. So I have that one, and then I have my last one, y'all. We are down to the last diamond painting. That went too bad, a little over 30 minutes. Now I gotta put all this crap away. Okay, so this one is drama? So this one, hold up, there you go, is drama. Same thing, the cover minder, same thing with the, um, the drill pin. And I like this one because it does say, like this says advanced, but I think it's saying that it's advanced because it's a full, it's a larger painting. It gives you the information about the artist. So this is the licensed artwork and the design. So I like Diamond Dots. It's, I think it's a good company. They give you, um, they give you good canvases. The canvases are nice, the drills are fantastic. So, but that is my last one, y'all. That is everything. If you guys have any questions about any of my diamond paintings, um, just like leave me a comment, let me know which one was your favorite. Um, there are a whole lot of places out there that you can order from. Just check your resources. I want to thank everyone for stopping by and watching. I really appreciate the encouraging words. I appreciate you all 
uh, liking the videos, leaving the comments, subscribing, please continue to do so. Check out my Instagram page. I'll leave a link in the description. Alrighty, y'all. Y'all have a nice day. Remember to stay beautiful and stay blessed. Bye.